Hey Libras, this is your reading for mid-month October 2020. Someone resonated his sign. Thank you guys so much for coming back to watch your reading. Do appreciate it. We're going to take a look at past, present, and future um, energy here. Okay, we're going to look at any blocks or obstacles you may be facing. Look at that. Got the Ace of Cups coming in at the bottom of the deck here, Libra. Okay, so something new possibly um, happening for you. We also saw the Five of Swords here. So, um possibly a new relationship or a new situation or new energy moving in towards you here mid-month October but let me go ahead and finish this intro here um we're going to look at any blocks or obstacles that you may be faced with here Libra we're also going to look at your feelings uh your person's feelings as well this could be uh friends family a situation a co-worker um whatever energy comes out I'll let you know Okay, I want to let you guys know also that this reading is um, general, so it may not resonate with everyone. If it doesn't resonate, go ahead and check your other readings. I have some in the timeless reading uh, playlist. I also have some spiritual readings out for you as well. Okay, give me the past energy here for Libra. October 2020, is in a sign. Ooh. Okay, we're back at it again. We have the death card coming in, um, but it's coming in the reverse position here, okay? Um, so something is going to change when it comes to you or situation, um, and it has to change here with the tower card moving in. So this is something that needs to change that um, has to change for you in order for you to move on to the next level, the next stage, the next phase. Uh, these are the words that's being given to me, okay? Maybe some of my Libras, you are living under false securities right now, or um, you're dealing with a situation and it's built on a faulty ground, because I'm seeing sand, like a castle built on sand. It won't last, sure, rushes up and is gone, okay? So uh, I feel like the spirits are breaking things down for you right now at this moment you have to revisit a situation. There's that five of swords, okay? This probably was a relationship of some time, of some kind, okay, that you had a lot of conflict with. They're making you uh, take notice of it. I don't know why you're going backwards here, but it feels like some of you guys are going backwards a little bit. Um, maybe so that you can have um, clear karma or clear out some karma, karmic debt. Let me just make that clear, karmic debt. Um, or there was a lesson that needed to be learned and you didn't get the grasp of it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're going to see exactly what this is. Okay. Oh my goodness. They're saying pull another card for this. I have to pull another card for this, Libra. Give me one moment. There we go. You're going back to something very quickly knight of wands this time do things differently if you have to revisit a situation um that you struggle with before okay i don't know what the situation is i'm not going to sit here and pretend like i do know but you know <laughs> all right and it possibly could be love it could be a situation with a family member or a job or um something that you have to um address okay there is some transition that you were supposed to go through after you learned the lesson um but i feel like something is being revived this could be somebody from the past coming back i don't know if we're talking about love okay because the death card is coming up with the revival of some type here okay like something comes alive again after it was ended maybe um time apart what from a partner was only temporary okay even though it, there was some chaos surrounding you guys okay um you may see someone come back that you really did care about um but maybe the situation surrounding you guys will be different this time let's see what happens okay let's take a look at their feelings i mean not their feelings what's going on with this person in the past okay past energy here okay um strength card coming out for them five of cups i 
feel like the heartstrings are being pulled for both of you guys here. The past energy is letting me know something is about to happen between you two, okay? The Knight of Cups is coming out for them. It's coming out in a reverse position here, though, okay? So maybe you were in a relationship or in a connection that you both weren't very happy in, okay? Um, maybe there's second chances coming back around, though, okay? Let's get the overall energy here. broke up or ended something with someone presently what's happening with libra in this situation in the present moment this is all past okay hierophant card for you libra and the page of swords in the reverse position coming out for you so um I feel almost like there is this situation that's coming back together. Careful, though, because we're going through this Mercury retrograde. Make sure that you speak to whoever this is and let them know how you feel from the heart. And make sure the message is clear because the page of swords in the reverse position is about uh, messages not being received well. Okay. Or you not being heard clearly. Um, not being understood clearly here, okay? Let's take a look. I'm going to actually bring out another card for you guys. I'm just going to have to keep digging at this. I see a commitment coming back together here in a temporary pause in the past for you, Libra. There's going to be balance or more balance between you and this person this time. But make sure you guys are on the same page here. I'm not going to look at the six of pentacles and say things are not balanced. Maybe um, this person makes more money than you or vice versa. You make more money than them. Okay. Um, but I feel like this time around, since this is coming in the present moment with the Hierophant card, uh, the Six of Pentacles is that you're going to find an equal give and take for you both here. Um, and you're going to find a way to make things fair. The Six of Pentacles is bringing in balance and generosity, okay? Both of you will start to contribute equally um, here this time. But it's only going to be done with clear communication, okay? The communication has to be on point. And I don't see that you have a problem with this, Libra. I feel like you have very good verbal skills. You could talk very well, communicate very well. So just make sure whoever this is, if they do come back around, okay, that they understand you very clearly. Let's take a look at what's happening with them here. Okay. They have the Seven of Cups coming in. Oh, goodness. Page of Cups in the reverse position. You're dealing with someone that's very emotional. Maybe a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, that don't make decisions very well. This is why you got to make sure communication is clear with this person. Because they may be all over the place a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Um, <laughs> the Page of Cups is like this person is uh, resistant in some way to hearing you fully um or they are just their emotions are all over the place and uh there's an inability to really make a concrete decisions pisces have that <laughs> issue sometimes okay um we're very creative with our mind but we're, we're kind of spacey a little bit at times here okay um they have the ace of pentacles but it's coming in why is it coming in a reverse position why okay why never okay all right there this person may have financial worries when you guys come back together um i know you guys like i don't want to hear about a past person but this person it, it feels like the universe is having you move into um another go around with this person i'm gonna get the overall energy on why this may be happening here okay One more time. There we go. Jeez. 
communication was a problem between you. Some of you guys don't want to talk to this past person, and that is totally fine. I understand if you don't want to revisit a connection. But for my Libras that do want to revisit a connection, because I'm seeing two stories from the past here, okay? Seeing one group that wants to revisit that did not want to let it go, but there was emo emotional trauma that you guys were dealing with, okay? Um, it just feels like communication is going to be a struggle with this person. You have to be on the same page. Um, this is for the those that want to get back, okay? If you get past communication is issues, you can bypass any setbacks and wasted effort and time um, put towards a connection that's just going to fail again, okay? Let's take a look at their feelings. I hide behind material things. Issues with money. I'm going to get those around deck. Let's take a look at why this is happening. Why they are hiding behind material things. And someone is saying they feel safer in the silence here. Okay. They have the Four of Cups coming in here. Jeez. And they, okay, they don't have control, basically. <laughs> they don't have control over themselves. Maybe they overspend or they overcompensate for... Um, I just don't see it. I don't see it happening. It feels like this person may be closed-minded somewhat, not open to really putting their effort into making the relationship work. Um, very restless individual that you may be dealing with here, okay? Maybe your message here is to uh, really take a look at the connection that you have with whoever this is. It could have been a lover. It could have been a friend. It could have been a family member someone you work with and see if you actually want to go through this type of roller coaster because that's what it feels like again here um libra let's go ahead and take a look at your feelings okay that's disappointing so it feels like <laughs> I want to be more than friends. What should Libra know about the situation here, though? We've got to bring it out. What should Libra know about this, these feelings of wanting to be more than friends? Five of Pentacles. But it's going to be a rough road. <laughs> It's going to be a rough road with this person here, okay? You may come back together with the Three of Pentacles, okay? But you may have money issues. You may have issues um, in the beginning if you're not on the same page. If you can't communicate and this person is unwilling to bring in change towards their thinking, basically. Blocks and obstacles here for Libra. Saying, is it worth the time? Is it worth worth the effort? Basically, okay. Libra, you are very sweet, okay. You're a giver, um, but you don't have to sacrifice and deplete yourself. That's what I'm feeling here. Deliver, deliverance. This is your obstacle. Deliverance. Look how they're looking. Like almost like the tower card. Look at the um resemble resemblance of it. Okay. And what is saying deliverance. The lightning strikes here. They're talking about release, relief, 
a fresh approach to this obstacle with this person, liberation from obstruction, finding a solution and exhilaration, okay? All of my cross watchers that's watching for Libra, this is for you as well. And I almost feel like I want to do the reading over, but somebody needs to hear this. Either it's the cross watcher or it is you, Libra. I don't know which one, but I'm I'm just going to keep going with this reading. I can't make it sound good all the time here, okay? Great power. This is your obstacle <laughs> here for the cross watcher, okay? Uh, great power, strength of character, authority. Since your emperor card is coming in reverse here about how you feel, leadership. They're talking about you taking responsibility for the way that you're acting here, cross watchers. And I have to say this, they're talking about self-confidence and dignity, um, being an influence. And they're, they're really talking about you taking control and taking responsibility for the things that you do say and act upon okay you give it more love maybe libra needs more love and they need to be shown more love here i don't usually talk to my cross watchers but I, it's just coming out this way okay there's a choice that you need to make either love this libra or you have to let them go basically okay that is your obstacle you taking control or responsibility of your own feelings here strengthening your character okay being a leader um or playing your part in a connection or a relationship basically that is what is telling me here okay let's look at future energy here for you king of swords they're saying it's up to you here, Libra, whether or not you want to keep going with this connection. Um, you're very, uh, you're a critical thinker, okay? Um, and I feel like the question is, is it worth your time to go into something or try to uh, revive a connection or a relationship here. The thought was in your mind in the past because it's here, okay? Um, some type of energy of you wanting to revisit a situation here, okay? Which did not free you to move on to something new. Let's take a look at their future energy. Okay, <laughs> why is this 10 of pentacles coming in? Or there be a turnaround between Libra and this person, okay? 10 of pentacles is not bad. Yes, ah! that is crazy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I hope you guys made it to the end of this video because we started off with this card. The Ace of Cups. The answer is yes. This person is going to turn around. Okay. There will be a turnaround. All right. Maybe they get struck in their butt by one of these lightning strikes. Okay. And figure out that they do need to give love. Or they need to start doing this and making plans with you, Libra. Um, for a better long-term relationship or future with the Ten of Pentacles uh, coming in here. Okay. Okay. I just want to let you know, though, <laughs> this person, whoever you're dealing with, they do like material comforts. That's why they're saying I hide behind material things. Maybe they find themselves very comfortable um, with material things here. OK. Um, but I feel like they all they also want to be happy because. They want something that's long term with you, even though this person may realize that they like material comforts here. They understand that material comforts doesn't mean happiness. And the Ace of Cups is letting me know that they also want happiness. They want to be happy with you. OK, because the Ten of Pentacles is about a family unit um, and having a strong family unit. Bam, bam. OK, so will there be a turnaround with this person? Yeah. <laughs> They're, they may have this uh, awakening that they need to uh, work 
on strengthening their character, okay? And working with you in a connection in some type of way here, okay? All right, I hope this reading was helpful, um, Libras. Thank you guys so much for coming back to watch your reading. I do appreciate it. Make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, let me know how you feel about the video in the description box. I will see you guys later. Bye. I love you.